All right, fans, this is Brady Lieber from TriStateFootball.com. You're looking at Connor head coach Dave Trosper after a big playoff win, 20 to 19 against the crosstown rival Cooper Jaguars. Coach, another come from behind victory against the Jaguars. Just tell me how you feel right now. Well, I mean, just I feel awesome for our kids. You know, um, they, they never give up. They always believe in what we're doing. They come to practice every day, no matter what the conditions are, and they continue to get after it. And that's the key. You know, uh, I take my hat off to Coach Borchers and the Cooper Jaguars. You know, uh, they, they, they played a great year. They came back strong. They had some injuries early. They're a young team. And, and he just keeps getting them to play. And, that, and that's what it's all about. But but I'm proud of our guys. We, we, we overcome adversity all the time um, and, and we just continue to keep that fight going and that's what it's all about. Well, part of the adversity now both teams had to play in it but the field conditions are pretty poor here today. It's rained all season long and it's hard for a grass field to take that man. Just talk about going out there and just keeping the kids focused. Well I mean that's seven weeks that we've played at home that it, it's rained. Um, it's saturated our practice field, saturated our game field. Our guys our guys are mutters. They'll tell you right now they enjoy it. They they have fun in it and they just continue to, to keep coming after it and that's what it's all about. It's we don't worry about the things we can't control, and, and we worry about what we can not control, and that's playing between the lines. It's pretty clear that, you know, because of the conditions and the wind, the passing game wasn't going well, so you kind of switched it up. One of the power running game. Just talk about making that adjustment. Well, I mean, it wasn't really adjustment. We, we did some of the same things we've always done. We just we got a little versatile with the RPOs and, and mixed the RPOs in, and, and that, that gives Jared the freedom to read some things, and they got to guess right. If they don't guess right, then he's able to, to do some things. So I don't know what his numbers were passing wise, but there, there was about four balls that were dropped that were hit right in the chest. So I, I think he did some good things throwing the ball, and then we were able to mix it up. And that's what we we need to do is mix it up. And Jared Hicks, your quarterback, probably made the play of the game, maybe even the play of your season. It was a jump pass. I heard you tell Terry Bemker that was a true it's RPO. A pass, it's an RPO. But it but that's how it came yes. out, man. Just talk yes. about how that how that developed and and, and how Tate Niedermeyer did the rest. Well, it's a, it's a it's a pool stuff, something that we do with our quarterback back fake to the back one the other way he comes off he's able to read the, the outside linebacker if the outside linebacker comes he can dump it he strung it out a little bit so it then it forced the backer to come and then when he did he was able to, to dump it over top of everybody and Tate did the rest and then I'll get you out on this one you know a lot of the so-called experts really didn't give you guys a chance this year and you're now at nine wins and you're in third week of the playoffs man just talk about keeping your kids focused on on keeping the noise out and just staying concentrated at the task keep at picking us that way <laughs> that, that, that keeps them focused. I mean, every one of you guys pick us. I don't think you picked us to win yet. Um, you know, that, that's what that's the way it's been all year. Is it, even Greg last week when I talked to him on the radio, he said, make sure he sees this. You know, he said you got to play Cooper, man. They're really coming on strong. You get you got to play them. Well, you know, we don't get the respect that we want, so that thrives for us and that keeps us going. That's something we thrive on, and we'll continue to do that. Um, playing the underdog role doesn't bother me. We, I've done it for 12 years now since I've been here. All right, congratulations, Coach Dave Trosper. Big win. We'll see you next week, bud. All wins are big. That's right, and they're good, too. Yes.